it's Natalie and welcome to this week's plan with me. This week I am using the Bloom Kit by Little Miss Papery and I thought it was just perfect for the beginning of spring in Australia. So the first thing that I'm doing here is placing um, the Dear Self You Are Strong quote up in the top corner and I thought that looked really pretty. And then I am going to place all the full boxes along the bottom of the planner. So I am lining the bottom edge of the full box with the bottom notes row in the bottom bar. And um, this kit doesn't come with bottom washi, so that's why I'm doing it this way. And I actually kind of prefer the look of my planner when I don't use bottom washi. I feel it looks a lot more fluid and streamlined. And I have been really enjoying that layout. So was glad to use a kit without bottom washi this week. So I'm just alternating colours and patterns here. And there's also two more quote boxes um, on Wednesday it says she believes she could so she did and on Friday it says when nothing goes right go left and I will link um, Little Miss Papery shop down below and with a coupon code that gets you 10% off um, and I also purchased this kit in glossy if you were wondering as well Little Miss Papery does make her kits in matte too so I am using the date covers from Colourpop Caper Co. They're my favourite and I chose the green colour because I thought it was nice and bright and it tied in um, the green that was in the kit. So um, I've done this before. I am extending the planning space of um, the week by lining up my to-do checklists and with the top of the header box and then on top of that I place my to-do header and then on top of that I place my date cover so yeah that gives me a lot more space in the middle of the day in my today section because um, I did have a lot going on this week and Little Miss Papery's Little Things labels are a lot thicker they're probably double the size of a header um, so I did need two leaves of space for those as well as well so I decided to place the darkest ombre heart checklist in the middle and then fan out the colors so I went from the deep pink to the pink the green and the blue and I think that looked really nice that's something that I don't usually do and now I'm just going to place all the date covers on top and I did place the date dots before I laid the date covers down because that makes it so much easier I think this is one of my favourite kits ever um, and I'm so glad that she stocks it in her shop pretty much all year round. So pretty and definitely was the perfect choice for the first week of spring. Um, spring is my favourite season. I'm spring baby. My birthday is on October the 18th and I just think spring has the most perfect weather. So under all the ombre heart check boxes I have placed my today headers on each day and now on the top I am placing a washi strip from one orange snowflake and using that to block off the days from Wednesday to Friday because my sister is has gone on a trip to Canberra and I'm just trimming that with my exacto knife um, it worked out really well putting the washi here because um, you would have seen before that there was the um, September flag that was peeking out behind the date cover and so that covered it up nicely and so I'm just trimming it off from either side because it was a bit too thick and was hanging off the edge of the page And now I'm just going to place a little plain sticker and that's from Hello Petite Paper because obviously she is going to fly there. And now I'm going to move on to the day by day. So on Monday I um, had to uh, make um, 
report my earnings. So I've put a dollar label there that I'm going to move down later. And on Tuesday it was payday, so I used a little washi strip from the kit along with a payday sticker. And that's one of the little Miss Papery decorative icons, which are so stinking cute, um, and I was happy to use those this week. Um, so you can see on Monday, I've moved back to Monday, I used a star label um, to mark week six of the semester. And then I placed a TV label because the block is on. And then I'm going to place down that dollar sign label again. And um, I didn't want to have a little thing section. You'll notice that I didn't actually use the littlest headers because these are more like labels rather than little things. When you stack them up together, I think it looks very blocky and very heavy and I don't like that. So I've just spaced them out um, and placed the, the label when I would actually do that item during the day. So it's all chronologic. So um, on Monday, I also placed a half box um, because I am going to work on some diverse papery stuff and then university stuff and also fill my monthly plan with me. And then I used the daily chore sticker because I need to clean and I used an icon from the kit and um, a makeup brushes sticker from Oh Hello Stationery Co. And then on to Tuesday, I used a half box from the kit along with two Clever Girl Craft heart icons to mark my classes. And then I also placed a TV label because the block is on again. And now I'm just moving everything up. Um, I have quite the space between classes. Um, like a few hours so I've used a meal label because I will definitely go and buy lunch and then I used um, a washi strip from the kit um, just to mark what I do during my um, break and then I used a crown label just so I could um, mark that my um, giveaway ends um, that was the Planner Sister Sticker Kits um, on last Tuesday's video. So that ends on Tuesday. And now on to Wednesday, I am placing another TV label because The Bachelor is on and another one for the block. And I'm also going to place a washi strip from the kit and a meal icon because I'm going to the Queen Victoria Night Market and it's actually the end of the Winter Night Market on Wednesday. And I placed a dollar sign because I need to release a payment, um, that little icon at the top. And then I also placed another crown icon because my Scribble Prince Co. Gold, give, gold Bold Medals giveaway ends um, on Wednesday and then I also placed a washi strip there as a half box because I need to post the giveaways and then also do some work on university stuff and Nervosa papery. So now on to Thursday I am just using a phone label because my new phone plan starts and then on the bottom there I have placed another TV icon for The Bachelor. And I am placing another half box because I have a university and um, I was just <clears throat> moving things around there so there's an even main amount of white space on each side of the label. And again, I'm using my Clever Girl Craft foiled hearts um, to mark each of my classes. And I am using a Instagram little label um, to remind myself to take my midweek photographs in all my planners for Instagram. And on Friday, I am using an aeroplane label because my sister arrives home from Canberra. And I'm placing a half box because that'll be my filming day. And I'm placing the planner from the Little Miss Papery kit. And I'm using a, another washi strip with the happy mail icon so I can record all the happy mail that I received throughout the week and what I filmed in my hauls because I do that every Friday for the week. And I also use another washi strip with an alarm clock because I have an appointment that I need to go to. And moving on to the weekend, I've placed 
a <clears throat> book little thing because I have an essay due on Monday and also a TV label because the block is on again <laughs> and um, now I am using two washi strips to cover up the dark headers on the weekend and then placing my weekend banner on top and I am using the balloons little label just to mark that it's Father's Day and a thicker washi strip and the balloons um, to mark that we're go having a Father's Day lunch with our extended family. I love the little balloons, they're so cute. And I'm also using another washi strip with the laptop icon. You guys know how much I love the little Miss Papery laptops. So I can edit and upload all the YouTube videos for next week. And on to Saturday, oh, well, actually on Thursday, I just placed the me time label in the kit because I have some time um, before I go to university in the afternoon. And on Saturday, I am placing the movie marquee um, because we're going to go out um, as a family for Father's Day um, and watch a movie, we'll probably watch the Bourne the latest Bourne movie and then I put a meal label because we'll also have dinner and then I also I used the paw print label and covered that with a coffee cup because I'm going out for brunch with a friend and then I used a, another washi strip to block off some time and the camera icon because it'll be a filming day. So uh, I'm now moving on to the sidebar. I am using the important header with an ombre heart checklist for my YouTube. I'm using an adulting header with another checklist um, for my spending and then a goals header um, for my YouTube and Instagram statistics um, to record those and I'm using another ombre heart checklist. So. I actually save this um, very light pink so I could have the sidebar be all the same colour and the Little Miss Papery checklist comes with six so for my spending and um, statistics section I write Monday to Friday in the little heart and then a W for the weekend and then that works well as a tracker so all the colours match and all that on off camera and filled everything out and now I'm just showing you everything that I have left from the collection and that's a finished spread guys thank you so much for watching please like this video subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram at Aversa Scribbles and I'll see you next time bye